Hey, Toy Addicts. I just um, was going through some stuff that I had to list, and I found some Barbie magazines, and I thought you guys might like to see this one. This is the premiere issue of Barbie magazine. Now, I have videos of Barbie magazine from the 60s, so this isn't actually the first Barbie magazine, but um, I guess it's the first one in the 80s. This is winter 1984. So we have, it looks like Angel Face Barbie here. Dazzling party dresses, super hairstyles, great gift ideas, and exciting Barbie adventure. Ooh, let's get into it. Let's see what we got here. First things first, we have ads in this magazine, which are awesome. This is a Monchi Chi ad. Monchi Chi means happiness. Not sure if it really does, but it's pretty cute. <laughs> I loved Manchi cheese. And here's our table of contents. It's like some interesting stuff. We've got another ad here. Miss America 2003? Question mark. McDonald's and you. You can pause this here if you want to read it. And we've got a Barbie talk section. Looks like Barbie is telling you some of her favorites, like the Thriller album, stickers, Mickey Mouse. And then it's interesting that this is the first issue of the magazine, but it has a full section of reader letters. Hmm. Even has pictures. So I'll kind of go over some of these quickly. If you want to read them, you can pause it. And then we will switch to what's happening. On TV at this time, you had a show called Boone on NBC. Do not remember that show. Reading Rainbow, of course. Now I'm going to have that song stuck in my head. And Mr. Smith. NBC Monkeys Around on a new show as only a real live orangutan can do. He's a clever chimp who can talk just like people do. Bet he says that a talking monkey is a great idea for a funny TV show. I don't remember that either. Mr. Smith. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. And then records. Looks like we have a Richie Rich record. Story of the Nutcracker. Sesame Street, Born to Add. This is an awesome record. I have that one. Benji. Very cool. We've got movies here. Um, Olivia Newton-John. And oh, we're still on records, I guess, because we're we're looking at Thriller there and Janet Jackson. And then for movies, Cross Creek. Hmm. I don't remember that one either, but I do remember Mickey's Christmas Carol. That was awesome. Here's a ad for a subscription, which makes a great Christmas gift, by the way. Won't it be great to have Barbie magazine in your mailbox? Here's the um, information if you want to try and subscribe. Not sure they're still sending out issues, but you never know. <laughs> and here's more what's happening. This seems like a lot of advertising. Barbie book report. The chocolate book. The fairies nighttime book. And then, of course, we talk about the rescuers and a Christmas story. And those are both 1984 classics. I think The Rescuers came out earlier than that. But um, Good Looks and Good Health. So maybe some ways to match your clothes. I'm not sure. <laughs> Healthy Eating. Be an Angel Face this winter. Let's see. I'll zoom in here so you guys can... 
read this if you want to pause and read it. Good soaps for great skin. I'll take some health and beauty advice from Barbie. <laughs> um, we're still at good looks and good health. Pretty hair for the holidays. So <laughs> I wouldn't recommend using this little device in your own hair for sure. <laughs> But then again, I guess maybe you could. I remember this getting the Barbie's hair super tangly. If you didn't use it just right. Here's a pet page. Making a present for your pet. Maybe a fun box for your cat. You know how cats love boxes. <laughs> and then we have some casual clothes for play days, rainy days, and any day. And these are fun, typical 80s style clothes. Bright colored leggings and tights. And we have an AIM ad. About caring for your kids' teeth. I think that's more directed at parents. Now this right here. It's called All I Want for Christmas is Mattel. It's a 1983 wish list. And I've actually had one of these before. And so I do have a separate video that shows all of these close up. And I will link it up here in the corner. And if you can't see that link, you can um, look at the Poochie stuff. Oh my goodness. Uh, you can search it on my channel as well. He-Man stuff, Hot Wheels, all the good Mattel. And there's some shopping tips here. You'll get Barbie's little shopping store set that you can buy. And then party dresses. The prettiest party dresses for the best holiday ever. Oh man. Um, yeah, these are all like sweatshirt dresses, I think. I would totally wear most of these <laughs> right now. So, yeah. And then we have a Barbie Christmas party, little sort of a comic with actual pictures of Barbie. And ooh, driving around the Corvette. Uh oh, I hope she's not going to run Ken over in there more oh here's barbie at mcdonald's and hanging out with her friends and this is kind of a cool ad here this is um an ad for nickelodeon and it actually is a fold out so let me see if i can show you the whole thing here i'll show it to you sideways and then we'll look at top so it's a big like three page thing and tell me if you remember let's see let me get it here without glare there we go tell me if you remember any of these people or characters 1984 was a little early for us to have cable we didn't have it quite yet so i'm not sure if i recognized a lot of these and then they also had prizes here that you could win you could win um ten thousand dollar maybe that's a bond or a scholarship video recorder atari in 1984 yep a VCR with movies, a giant Nickelodeon poster, an Atari 1200XL home computer. 64K computer is compatible with over 2,000 Atari software programs. Did they really have 2,000 software programs? You could win a Nickelodeon shirt, 
and even a camera. Here it talks about some of the shows. Explore the world of Nickelodeon. You can't do that on television. Of course I remember. Wild Rides. No, I don't remember that one. Against the Odds. I don't think so. Mr. Wizard. Yeah, I do remember that. Stand By. Lights, Camera, Action. Hmm, that doesn't seem familiar. Reggie Jackson's World of Sports. Probably not, but I doubt I would watch it if it was on. I wasn't really into sports that much. I was into wrestling, but they never really covered that in sports things back then. Kid Rights Going Great and Live Wire. No, I do remember you can do that on television, of course, and Mr. Wizard, but I think the rest of them, I don't really know. Do you guys know any of those? Here's the other side of your subscription and then here are some delicious ideas from barbie some a cranberry cooler recipe alcohol free of course <laughs> this says you can do it and i think it's like crafts and stuff that you can do projects you can make a bangle belt And simple gifts you can afford to give. A write-on gift. It's like something that has to do with stickers. We were all into stickers back then, right? This says, home sweet home. One look in your room and you'll know it's holiday time. Winter spring cleaning. And, oh, this is kind of funny, this planter. Oh, it's like a mug that they planted this cactus in, but it has feet. <laughs> Tricks and teasers. Can you find the presents? Hmm. Let's see. Do you see them? <laughs> and we're learning about some more games again. Here's a little crossword puzzle and a word to find. Let's see if we can answer any of these. One across, you might blank a potato to make it soft. Boil, I'm guessing? What a baby might wear while eating. Ooh, bib. Let's see if there's any Barbie involved ones here. Hmm. Nope, doesn't look like they could come up with any clues that have anything to do with Barbie. Okay. Oh, we've got some more games here. Fun in the snow. Oh, here's our answers. What's the fastest way to get to the latest toys? It's definitely riding your big wheel all around this maze until you get to Toys R Us. These other toy stores, I think, are... Um... Sorry, pal. We won't have Mori the Moose for at least two weeks. <laughs> sure, but we'll have to order Bunny Doddle in from our warehouse, and that could take... Let's see... Bunny Doddle. Huh? You never heard of space spoons? Are you sure you know what you're talking about? <laughs> you know what? I think if you went to Toys R Us and asked for space spoons, they'd be like, um, no. <laughs> Don't think so. And here's the most awesome ad in here. It's for Poochie. Poochie stampers were the best. I wanted everything Poochie in 1984. <laughs> and is this Joey Lawrence? What do you guys think? Is that him when he's little? Or maybe it's his brother? I'm not sure. 
Okay, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed this 1984 Barbie Premier Issue magazine. And check out my other Barbie magazines that I have um, shown you guys here on the site. I've got a few from the 60s that I think you'll really enjoy. And make sure to check me out on Instagram at Jody Toy Attic. The, all the details are down in the description. And if you feel like buying me a coffee or a cupcake, if you enjoyed the video or any other videos and you get some, some uh, kind of enjoyment out of it, you could do that. The link is down below too. Otherwise, make sure you comment down below, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye!